Hey guys, it's the Scientific Doctor here. Welcome to part four, I believe it is, of The Walking Dead Season 2, episode one. Uh, I do need a little refresher, although uh, I did have to play a bit. Uh, I had to play the uh, last cutscene where I talked to the uh, new characters and just basically had to do that part over again. And people have always asked me, or like, people always get asked, how, how do you how do you know you didn't uh, choose something different and really if you answer the question truthfully your opinion wouldn't change uh, based on being asked again so uh, in, especially if you haven't gone any farther in the game so my opinions were the same right so I obviously chose the same choices so I got some fishing line and she said she can stitch it so I've totally forgot about this stuff um, I'm not gonna pry it with the knife. I remember I need to grab the hammer. Uh, so I need to find a way to use something in here. I know I got it last time, but I'm just going to search everything and just get refreshed here. It's been a couple of days. Um, I have I've had problems uh, not only with my internet. Uh, it took a couple of hours to upload an 18-minute video. I thought it was YouTube's fault uh, because I uploaded a video while that one was uploading and it uploaded in five ten minutes and it was the same length so I don't I thought it was YouTube um, so here we go I think this is what I do right I use the folding table and I climb up onto the folding table and I can probably grab the hammer all right come on Clementine Oof. Oof, that hurt um, and she landed on her arm too, so that's gotta suck. Uh, we can grab that hammer for sure though. And then we'll be all caught up here. I think uh, I grabbed the hammer Hank Hill style and then I uh, ended it, so we're back to where we were. Let's uh, use the hammer on these. I'm gonna pry the board if it'll let me hammer use the hammer all right there we go oh Q I like the uh, new heads-up display it's very nice it's very flashy but nice um, let's kick the panel I think I don't know what exactly she's gonna do but I think she's just gonna escape pretty much um, I don't know. It's now nighttime apparently and it's raining. Doctor, he's got to have stuff for stitches. Oh, so we're just going to sneak in and try and uh stitch ourselves up. Apparently is that a walker? I guess so. Oof. But yeah, Clementine definitely looks older. I can't get over uh, how she looks so much older. And she's only like tops of 12, I'm guessing. She's probably in between 10 and 11, but I'm guessing a max of 12. Um Hmm. Ooh. So a lot of choices here on how to sneak in. Obviously not front door. Don't want to do back door. I'm going to check. Uh... Ooh, and there's more windows. I'm going to check this window. The one on the far left looked like uh, it's way too high. And there's lights on in that, so I'm not going to do that. She definitely looks older. She's tall. I noticed... Uh, She's taller, like way taller, which gives the effect. I think it's getting worse. Um, but she's still not that tall. She's like middle school height, like she's around ten to thirteen, uh, is what it seems like. I'm just gonna check all the windows here. Come on. And apparently it's not working. Uh there's a walker over there. He keeps showing me that. It's kind of uh making me think that something's gonna happen. Uh, can't use any of these windows. Um, but yeah, I've been uh, really psyched to play this. And I went to upload today and I realized I had no footage. So uh, I just immediately tried to get on. And not only did I have the uh, internet problems, but I also had uh, the Walking Dead problems. Uh, apparently when I use my PS3 controller on the computer, it errored out the uh, DLL files or the DI or the D input uh, on The Walking Dead Season 2 and 1 
the Telltale uh, has no controller support, so it's like uh, really weird. When I uh, plug in the controller, the game won't start up, but now it wouldn't start up even when it was unplugged, so I had to go find a fix for that, and I did. Uh, is there a way to open window or look at? I'm just gonna look. I don't know if they'll see me. It makes me feel like a fucking idiot when we're not on the same page. Hmm. We are on the same page. Not so those two are one. fighting. Not about the girl. I thought he gets soft. Uh, what do you want me to but do? obviously what he brother? wants to help I me. To think about our and she does not. That's all I think about. So. so don't give me shit. He definitely looks like an older version I of Lee. Like, uh, he actually reminds me of Lee's father, to be honest. Um. Who? I'm gonna knock. I'm gonna knock, yeah. She seemed to uh, have exited the, the room, so uh, I'm gonna ask. I'm just gonna say I, I need your help. I need your help. Me? No, I'm sorry, but I can't do nothing. Say uh, Please, I need a needle. I need to fix my arm. Are you out of your mind? Even if you ain't bitten by some lurker, which you probably are, you can't be here. Come on. You gotta get out of here. You understand? Get back into that shed and Carlos will take care of you in the morning. Can tell you're tell nice. You're nice. Yeah. I ain't nice. Oh yeah, you are. Yes, you are. Don't you do that. I saw when everyone was arguing. Ah, oh, the dialogue is just help. so perfect in this game. You didn't see anything. Look, you gotta get out of here before my wife finds you. I'm serious. Um, you gotta go. I got enough problems already. Got a baby on the way, Rebecca. Ah, I like how they give us more time, but hormones causing all sorts of trouble. I don't need any more. Get it? All right. Oh. I'm just gonna ask for more help. Please help. Please. Don't cry. I'm not gonna cry. I'm just tired. Alright, so this is taking it. Not with Carver. No. This is taking a turn. You didn't get bit by a dead person. No. I'm gonna say this one. I won't forget that you helped me. I bet you won't. Right. I'm screwed if anyone finds out I did this. You understand? Alright, so he apparently is gonna help. My arm needs to be cleaned and stitched. Stitch? I ain't doing that. She almost said bite. Because it was a dog bite that did it. So she changed it to cut. So that's a little stutter there. A hiccup. So that's uh, pretty cool that the dialogue is like, they're being careful. The Telltale is being really careful about what these characters say. So I mean, it's very critical how these characters can react, which is just perfect if everything I choose does matter. And uh, it seems like it does, to be honest. Uh, I feel like stuff I'm choosing affects the game more than it should. <laughs> And I really appreciate that because, oh, he's even giving me apple juice. Thank you. But I'm just, I'm just appalled at like how much it actually does affect the game because <laughs> if you've ever played the David Cage games, you can uh, clearly see that nothing you choose in that game matters. So um, I'm glad that Telltale has taken uh, that idea of where it's you choose the dialogue and choose exactly what your character does and it really does affect them unlike uh, the other attempts that people have made to do that and the art style is very unique so it, it, it just really draws me in now I gotta find my way back to the shed I'm pretty sure it was this way so hmm. um, juice box rags hammer fishing line and pocket knife what is this plywood I'm going to uh, take a look here I'm gonna take a look before I pry open seems like uh, I need to use my hammer which I totally can do oh it's gonna make me do the hands first now I can use the hammer sweet let's do it might as well I don't see why not. I wonder what they keep under here though. Hopefully it's not like zombies. That'd be terrible. Oh, that looked like a biker. What is that? 
than a can. Hole in the uh, lattice, I think it was called. Who's under here? There, I can't look at the can. Seems to be a bike. What else do we have? I have no idea how long these uh, episodes are here. So I am hoping that it's longer. But you know it's got to end at some point, which kind of sucks. Uh, I'm going to try and push the trap door. Nope. Um, I keep using the inventory instead of the selector. I'm going to try the pocket knife. I don't know why exactly I'm uh, going into the trap door, but uh, Q might as well. Okay. Uh, she broke her knife, so that's not good. But I think she broke the lock, too. Yes, yes, you did. Okay, so we're listening in here. Whew, this is a uh, pretty. This is taking a weird turn from season one, uh, and it's it's still amazing though. I can't believe that taking such a turn like this is still catchy. Like season one. I was the dude making the decisions and here I'm the one undermining the decisions and trying to do my own stuff so apparently I uh, can listen in on their conversation here in the kitchen apparently they're in the kitchen okay what is this okay there we go they're talking they're having a thing okay I'm just listening in. Oh, 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 close the door. They did keep the uh, red around the screen like they did before. Let's back out. I don't really need to uh, hear any of that. It's not subtitled anyway, so you guys probably cannot hear it. Let's go over here. I can't go over there. Now, I don't know exactly why I'm in the house, to be honest. Because he already gave me all the uh, stuff, I, all the things I need. Just gonna take a quick look at Le Clementine here since uh, I can get a good shot here. So let's see. She's still got her hat. She looks a lot older in the face. And she looks really skinny. And she looks way taller. And uh, definitely aged. So just making a note of that. I just wanted to uh, look at that since uh, I had the opportunity. So what do we got? Just a couch, they're playing cards, they got candles everywhere, so that probably means no electricity, because there's a lamp right here, and everyone knows I love lamp. So let's see what we got over here. I cannot go over here. Oh, going up the stairs, apparently. I don't know why uh, Clementine is doing this. This is uh, pretty crazy for Clementine. Fishing? Is that what it... It says ishin, so I'm guessing it's fishing. Now it says fishing. Um, open the bathroom door or bedroom door. I'm gonna go be bathroom because uh, then I can clean out the wound and I can also uh, just be uh, stitching in peace here. It seems like a good spot. Uh, open the medicine cabinet. I was not thinking about medicine either. What do we have? What do we have? Uh, baking soda. What is this? Needle? Oh, I need one of those, yeah. Oh, it's even got the uh, needle thing to uh, hold the needle. I forget what it's called. Suture or something? Still need something to keep it from getting infected. So she needs a uh, disinfectant or uh, some form of cleaner. Hide, hide. I'm gonna choose the shower because there's no way there's running water if there's no electricity. And that looks like a pregnant Krista almost, but not a pregnant Krista. Because remember, she was pregnant and then it was 16 months later. And uh, she's just she just wants to have the baby apparently. She wants to get that over with. Let it be okay. And she, if she wants one thing to go right, she wants her baby to be okay. Whew. 
Okay, so we hid correctly. Very nice. I believe I can come out now. Let's do that. Whew. Wow. Some crazy uh, moments here. Okay. Let's open the bathroom door. Seems like uh, they're gone. Those are nice candles. Uh, let's check the bat the bedroom door. Ooh, very close in cutscene. Oh god. Oh, it's the little kid. It's the other child. You're not supposed to be in here. Um, I'm just gonna say, don't make a sound. Okay. So I wonder how old she is. She looks older than Clementine, but not by much. I'm guessing probably 15, 16, somewhere around there. Um, I didn't exactly hear. I'm gonna say help, but I won't tell. Apparently, she wasn't uh, supposed to be reading, or supposed to be up. I'm not sure which. Yeah, she definitely seems uh, older than Clementine, but just by a little bit. Um, I, I'm gonna say this one. This way, she kind of feels uh, Do you understand? she needs to help me. I just need something to clean it with. I bet it would be with the rest of your medical supplies. Yeah, it is. So I'm guessing. I'm guessing about 16, because she feels the need to take care of little kids and stuff like that. Um. I'm gonna say I'm Clementine. Might I'm as well. Clementine. Hmm. That didn't really uh, roll over. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. Apparently they're the same age. Girl. I'm gonna say we're not the That's same age. Because I'm pretty sure we're not. We're not the same age. What? Hopefully. We're not the same age. You said we were. We're not. Hopefully, they How say the real. I'm to I, I called that one. Called that one. I said 15 or 16. That was, that was right on the money. And she says she's a lot younger. So, uh. I'm guessing she's about 11. 10 or 11. I remember, uh. 16 months. Yeah, about 11. Crap. I didn't exactly hear it. I'm gonna say yes, though. Yes. Cause I don't want to let her down. Pinky swear. Yeah. Yeah. Pinky swear. Let's do it. Yeah. Alright. Getting hyped over pinky swears. Alright, so she's gonna look around for me. So, I wonder if that's like a diary or a book. I didn't really uh, get a good look. Alright, so what is this? That'll work. Disinfectant, apparently. So she's gonna go back to the shed and stitch her arm up. Hopefully. She's gonna sneak out of here. Thanks, Sarah. Okay. So. Okay. I'd better get somewhere safer to do this. Okay, so Clementine just knows what she has to do. I got hydro I got the peroxide. Pretty sure it's hydrogen peroxide. I need to get somewhere safe to do this. Uh, hopefully I can go back to the shed. Because that's where I want to go. This is I'm back where I'm supposed to be. And I can't get in trouble for that, right? Whew. Alright. So I gotta find that trap door again. This door, right here. Use the exit. Oh, I'm worrying about the camera. The way the camera works in this. I'm always worried that something's going to be going on in the background. Oh, good. I was supposed to do that. So, I'm back in the shed. And I gotta lock that door back up. Or the uh, wood plank that I moved. Uh, hopefully I do, because uh, otherwise um, Zambambos can get in. <laughs> Oof. Got the needle. I got fishing line. I got, uh, uh, like, a suture or... Uh, 
cloth and I got some apple juice and hydrogen peroxide. I was right, it was hydrogen peroxide. So uh, apparently we're definitely gonna have to do this. This we're... is gonna suck. <laughs> yeah, it will suck, I'm, uh, I'm sure of that. Why would I apple juice it? I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick up the apple juice. Yep, definitely need some apple juice, no doubt. So first off, gotta grab the needle, gotta thread the needle. Oh, wait, no, I gotta use disinfectant first. Hopefully she doesn't stick it in yet. Thread the needle. Okay, I'm just getting the needle set up, hopefully. Just like last time. Just how Chris last time? Me. What does this mean? I'm gonna back out. Set that down. Gotta disinfect. Okay, good thing they did that, too. Because, uh... Otherwise, I would have screwed with the disinfectant, so... Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, wait. Don't I need to use this with the disinfectant? Ah! Uh, oh! Wow! Ooh, that doesn't look good. That does not look good. She dropped the uh, entire thing. Wow, that was painful to watch. I can't uh, pick that up. Let me uh, rag it up. Oh, so those are bandages. Ever. At least I'll keep the stitches in place when I'm done. Okay. So I was not supposed to dab it in cloth, so... Wow. Whew, that was intense. Alright, so let's, uh... Get some apple juice. Some, uh, reward. Alright. Let's do this. Let's do this. Alright. Prepare to suture your arm. Here it goes. Oof. Wow. This camera, wow. And the voice acting's good too. She's bleeding, as we can see. But wow, the camera is just amazing. Ah, oh, I like this uh, form of QTE, but wow. That's gruesome. You're not can't scream that much there, Clementine. You're gonna attract some walkers. Here goes. Wow, she just stabs it in too. She might black out from the pain. Wow. She's tough though. Come on. You can do this. Oof. Wow. This is fishing line too, so that's gotta hurt. Let's do it. Can't back out now. Wow. Okay, the needle's kind of freaking out there, but wow. She's even screaming like crazy, too. That's not good. Does that mean this is, Oh, God. She's, like, blacking out. The vision's going blurry. You got this, Clementine. You got this, Clementine. Wow, that's gruesome. Wow. Good job, Clementine. Wow. That's crazy. Wow. Definitely gotta grab that apple juice. Oh. <sighs> Alright, let's, uh, let's grab the bandage. Wow. That was intense. No! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! Grab the hammer! Grab the hammer! No! 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 Ah, I'm using left and right. What? Q, Q, Q. I thought I was dead for a second. E. Wow, nice. Alright, grab that. Nice brick. Alright, he's on the ground. Grab the pitchfork. Grab the pitchfork. Welcome to my nightmare. Q, Q. 
Welcome to my world, right? That, that's Freddy Krueger, right? Ooh, nice. And the anchor, too. Alright, let's grab the hammer. Alright. <clears throat> How's it going, dude? What? Oh, yeah. Just like... Wow. This is exactly like Lee did in uh, Season 1, Episode 1. Ah. Still not bitten. Achievement unlocked. Holy shit. What the... Okay, I did it. And they noticed. The hell did it get in here? Little girl's tough as nails. Still all right? not bitten. The That's the way to go, Clementine. Still not bitten. <laughs> she is tough. I never was. And you left me out here to die. Wow. You patched yourself up? Absolutely. Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying okay. a baby. Enough there we go. Already. It's weird. The mouse no kind of disappeared for uh, choosing the prompts, Relax, though. Rebecca. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Wow. Sneaking around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? <laughs> she is totally was awesome right there. Oh, she gave him a cold shoulder too. Oh, that's incredible, dude. That's crazy. Wow. <sighs> it seems like we're patched up. Wow, Clementine, you're amazing. Lee taught you well. Whew. This might hurt a little. Uh-oh. All right, ne not nearly as bad as how it was. Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So it wasn't alert. No, bite? absolutely not. That's when what I was, said. The fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. Ha <laughs> ha! Take that, Kenny Jr. All right, we're good. Let's take a look at that arm. So I think it's going to be a one-on-one -on -one conversation with the doctor. I'm going to ask, "What do you mean?" What do you mean? Manipulated my daughter. Ooh. I asked for her help. She's not someone you can just ask for help. Why not? I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Oh, give me the uh she isn't like taking you. daughter to prime prom but once you're type thing for a while, speech. So you can't speak words today. How bad the world is. What is really like out there. She would Wow, so she or he is uh, protecting her by not letting her see what's going on in the world because he believes that she won't be able to um, handle it. You don't have to I, I chose that at the last second. worried you might be working with someone else, that your being here was no accident. I guess we'll find out. But one thing I know for sure. Are not to be trusted. Okay, so he's friendly when there's other people around, but he's really threatening and stay away from my uh, really, really stern without it. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. Uh, yeah, I'm hungry. But uh, I'm gonna have to wait and eat in the next episode. Thanks, you guys, for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video.